Okay. Uh. <laughs> I was literally about ready to go. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. I literally had like the heart, the arms. You were like ready to go and I'm just like... Uh. Guys, what is up there? Welcome back to a brand new Dragon Ball Super episode on the channel. Last episode, we got a bit uh, a bit of information about Goku Black. And then right at the end, we find out that Beerus has probably encountered this guy before. Whis is going to look into it. Adds a lot more mystery. And I'm really, well, we are really looking forward to seeing what's going on. So, uh... Let's get this. Guys, if you want to see the full length fun cut early access versions of these videos way before YouTube sees them, we do have a Patreon. The link to that is down below. But guys, if you could hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and let's go and get it. Scrubbed up nicely, isn't it? Yeah, she's done a good job. Looks clean. Yeah, I was wondering like what the time frame on getting this thing up and running is as well, you know? Yeah, that's kind of one thing that like, you never really know with Dragon Ball, do you? Like the time how long's passed between like little bits and bobs but i'd imagine almost with a time machine it doesn't matter how long it takes because you can just it's not like every minute that you're in here they're destroying the future because you can just go in time to before they did that yeah exactly so trunks hard at work obviously there yeah trunks is that guy that always goes to the toilet and his wife when well, he's at work all the time he just plays on his phone you know and he's just like wasting time I rate it. I'm gonna say that they're, 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 they're the guys we call heroes. Mm. <laughs> Mate, do you think he's like a little bit worried that his future self has stolen the heart of his maiden? That's a weird kind of jealousy, isn't it? Can you imagine that? Just like, like I'm jealous of me. Arigato. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, based off another time travel series, what they need to make this work is a microwave. I think you might be up to something there, you know? Mm. Gel nanas and whatnot. <laughs> Mate, I, look, I like I love that. I want one. Well, I don't, but I do. Yeah. Oh, he's trying to be his future self. Look at him, like his arms bent. I bet he's tensing. I know he's like tensing. He, oh, do you know what he's doing? He's doing that thing. If you prop it up in the back of your hand like that. Oh, <laughs> yeah, like look how ripped I am. That's why I always sit with my arms crossed, like when I'm doing videos. <laughs> Do you think Vegeta's trying to, like, because he knows he's going to die. He's like, I've got to train so that I don't die. Well, like, I just had the thought of, like, the reaction he had when Bulma got slapped. This this mm. Goku Black killed her. It's true. So, this is, like, ten times worse, isn't it? Mate, I love, like, how he cares about his family. Like, you know, yeah, like... Yeah, man, he, he can't keep it hidden, man. Like, you know... But then you're like, is it because he cares or is it because of his pride? You never really know. I think it's like, I think it is care, but it's in his I own way. So we're going to find out more. Who goes to bed with all their clothes on though? I know, tramp. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. Imagine if someone was just sat, sat by him, just like. Yeah. <laughs> They'd be gone. Oh, he's got fresh clothes there. Oh, we got some new guns. They look different. They look military color almost. Me too. A spy turtleneck as well. Yeah. Mate, they should have left like Goku Black's clothes there. Just mop some more. <laughs> <laughs> he just looks over and there's some white boots. He's like, oh! Just like a large cardboard cut out of Goku or something. Just <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the thing is, right, there was new clothes left on the side for him. But he's like, no, I'll just wear the ones that have got holes in them and blatantly smell. It, it, it adds to his uh, his moody vibe. Yeah. I bet wearing those clothes, right, it's like... Oh, did you see who it was? Oh, that was freaking... Uh, that was nipples, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Monica? Monica, yeah. Unless that they're just a species and they all look the same and it wasn't actually him, but, you know, who knows. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it shouldn't be funny. Oh, this whole scene. This whole <laughs> no, scene. I can't read it. Exactly. Go fucking change, man. Yeah, like even we spotted it and we weren't even. I know. We're not even in your fucking universe. I know. Other, other way, Bulma. Underarm. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. She's learning. They always get the shit jobs, don't they? I know, man. Also, where the fuck is Gohan? Oh, yeah. Probably at school. I guess. Oh, speak of the man. Oh, my God. He's not Gohan anymore. He's Clark. Yeah. 
Yeah, and that's coming from Gohan's dad right there. You ain't taking him. Yeah. It was it would have been perfect if he had taken him and then they had fucking fused up and then fucked up Goku Black, right? Mate, can you imagine that? That would be insane in the membrane. Mate. One arm. Artificial humans, you see. Yeah. That's what he just said. Yeah. Oh, that's still young trunk. So is he talking about the androids there? Yeah, yeah. Okay, that makes sense then. My Gohan looks fucking sick. Oh, oh sleep time. He just hit a... That was... <laughs> that was the ultimate was... move. <laughs> yeah, the, the Chudo Chuck. Fucking hell, man. It's crazy. Damn, imagine punching the floor with that much power, man. Super Saiyan. Is this how he managed to do it, then? Yeah. There we go. Fuck. Imagine you're just, like, at a lecture or something, and then you just look around and fucking Trunks is there with a big, sh big, big sword. <laughs> fucking Shanker. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, he's having flashbacks, like, Nam. <laughs> Waiting for him like a bully after school. Yeah. Didn't even recognize him. Yeah, he looks so much different, don't he, from like Trunks this time. He got weak. Yeah, man. But his ice cream! <laughs> like, Is he like, I've never had one of these? He's looking at Go on just like, man, you used to be such a like a fucking rock star now. Look at you, man. He used to be the Giga Chad. Yeah. Uh, we're thinking the same thing, kid. Don't worry. Mm. Oh, that's a setup, isn't it? Mm. Yeah, they've got to be welcomed into the, the crazy family that just accept this stuff. Mm. He's going to ask about himself, right? Like, nah, bro, you're dead. He's like, nah, nah. You were one of the first. He is a bit of a Chad, though. I give him that, though, still. Oh, she's growing a little bit, isn't she? Uh, mm. Got him. Remember the chop move you'd learn from Gohan in the future. <laughs> Just <laughs> she gangster. She don't give a fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god. What she can fly and shit? Mate, I wonder if she's gonna be like strong as balls then. The thing is, if she can float around like that, you can't take her outside because you need to put her on a lead. She just fucking fly away. She's already gone, isn't she? Bet she's outside <laughs> now. Oh no. Oh, shit. He's like, I want to. What happened to the the Gohan I knew, man? I want to go back to the future. <laughs> I don't like it here. <laughs> <laughs> My man can't put off his paper for one day when the guy comes from the fucking future. It's just rude. It's actually got to be quite haunting though, because you come back to the to the past and you're seeing all these dead people, everyone dead. He looks at that kid and just like dead. Yeah, you know, it's got to be quite dark. Especially how like peaceful everything is as well. I bet it's just like, oh god. Was that from that filler episode where he fought the... I think so, yeah. The, the dog people? I think it was. Doesn't that feel like a lifetime ago now already? It does. Best episode we've had so far, though. Oh, oh by a mile. All right, hate to see it. Hate to see it. Oh, man. See, this, see, now all I can think of is, like, he's just sitting there just thinking, this little child, I'm going to outlive it almost, and that's kind of dark, you know? <laughs> My... Yeah, why why is Pan got more like bollocks than Gohan these days? You know. So see, I wonder, like, you know, because Gohan had all this like potential and stuff like that. It's passed on, maybe. She's gotta have something, surely. Yeah. And then obviously our fucking granddar is Goku. So she's bound to be strong as balls. Yeah. Of course, her other grandpa is freaking Mr. Saiyan, so... Exactly. She she OP already. Send her to the future. She'll destroy him. <laughs> Let's put the baby in the time machine going, off you go! Sort it out! <laughs> Make me proud. <laughs> Let's go dinner time. Damn, some food. Dinner time is always the best time. We know this. It's confirmed. Mm, see, that's what I... That would always be in the back of my head. Yeah. Exactly. Poor guy, man. Poor guy. Because obviously he's got the motivation of like, all right, I'll make sure it won't happen to these guys. But at the same time, what happens to him? Because he's going to go back yeah. and there's going to be no one there. So he thinks. Yeah. He went around to see his friend for the first time and he didn't even change his clothes. Oh, yes. And took cool. his sword. <laughs> Just in case. <laughs> I bet he ate his dinner with it as well. 
<laughs> yeah, just like... <laughs> can't handle my training. <laughs> Cannot handle my training, traveler. <laughs> Time traveler. <laughs> Time traveler. <laughs> Maybe, yeah, so this could be crucial for him because he needs this to know why he's going, you know. Yeah, boy. That's my dog. <laughs> oh, oh, here we go. Is he actually changed? Oh, uh, mate. Clean. It is clean. Cheetah's like, where's the Saiyan army, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> I cannot wait to find out more, man. Oh, 100%, man. They're going to leave us on our right cliffhanger, aren't they? They, they will. Right then. We're going to get a little glimpse of him right at the end, aren't we? They got an earring just like Goku Black. Is it them? Mm. 